So there's just this big unknown out there, and every time you drop a probe in the ocean, you don't know what you're gonna what's what's you, what you're gonna see, and um, so I, I really like the sense of adventure. Well, I study the ocean because I love the ocean, <laughs> and I love it for lots of different reasons. Um, one is because it's a really exciting place to do science, to do physics, um, to learn about different processes that are controlling the ocean, the ocean climate, and interactions with the climate. Uh, I study the ocean because it's fascinating. It's a process of constant evolution. You're constantly learning. Uh, so I can surf and learn about surf. <laughs> it's a pretty easy question, really. I mean, you've got almost most of the world covered by water, so why wouldn't you study the ocean, considering that it has, houses, you know, such important uh, processes and animals that actually shape the terrestrial environment that we have? So. I am specifically interested in the ocean sediments because they carry a lot of information about past climate and that's very important for our understanding of future climate. Do you want to know why I want to study the ocean? This is why. 16 plastic bags per metre of coastline in the world going into the ocean every day, according to this article. This scientist. I've got to find out if it's true. Uh, I'm really interested in uh, how biological and physical processes uh, work together to regulate the productivity of the ocean. Well, I've always grown up around the ocean and I've always been interested to learn more about it. And that led me to decide to study the ocean. And now I'm interested in um, the link between phytoplankton and zooplankton, um, as well as other things, uh, especially physical processes. Well, I study the ocean because I find the organisms that live in the ocean absolutely fascinating. And um, I love what it teaches about us about uh, our own biology and our own evolution. I study the ocean because it's beautiful, incredibly complex, and uh, also it's a very big player in, in the way that uh, the climate is changing and the way that we can live our life and the way that the, the planet we're going to live for our children and for the future generations. So. Well, the ocean is a really complex system and why, why I'm studying because it provides these really difficult problems and these problems are getting answers to these problems, actually answering questions about the whole world how everything is interacting with each other and while we are studying just physics we can understand what is happening with biology, what is happening with geology and ocean is, in my opinion, ocean is the only one media on this planet where actually all these processes are interconnected and this complexity is really driving me crazy. So. I actually never planned to study the ocean. I was studying physics and looking for a way to make it applicable to the world that we live in. And I met a bunch of oceanographers, and they were this group of super friendly, interesting, passionate people. And I realized that I wanted to do what they did. And so I became a physical oceanographer. You can, one person can do uh, look at theory and run models and go out and make observations and develop instruments. and. Uh, so there's this other sense of adventure that you can just kind of, you know, use every tool that you can think of to try to figure out what might be happening, you know, in the ocean. So the ocean is such uh, a key part of how our planet functions that um, it's really important that we uh, understand the ocean, and um, therefore we can understand our planet much better. It would be kind of uh, silly not to study the ocean, in my opinion like playing in and around the ocean a lot and it's a really valuable resource for us and we have to be really careful about what we do in the future um, to make sure that we can always keep playing in the ocean. The ocean is just a fascinating place and it's just an incredible uh, chance to be able to study it. In some ways being an oceanographer is one of the last jobs where you still get to be an explorer and I love that going out and having that sense of discovery. The feeling of you know, going out and, and finding something new.